are seeing the KM Malo L. Interesting. I have not seen KML's Malo. This will be an interesting match to watch here. Can't wait. Jintan also going Rano. I feel like Jen usually goes Raster, but I know she's been trying out a different character this week because of a different controller. This is going to be an interesting match for both players. Going to Forest Floor. Good pick. I love this stage. Okay. KML just playing patient, just waiting for some of these openings. Just throwing these bombs, waiting for Jen to run into them. Who goes for a big bomb? Not gonna land. Fishing for some big bombs. I guess trying to take advantage of Rano has to go in. They're not flashbangs now. Ooh, good flashbang into upstrong combo, but the upstrong doesn't finish. Just playing patient. Jen trying to approach with some of these needles to stop KML from mashing. But the Molo bombs don't stop. Good parry into F strong from KML. Now Jen trying to find an opening. KML not throwing out bombs as much. Jen Tanzrano able to close the distance, but she just cannot find these good hits. That up air would have been good. Oh, KML goes for an up strong. Not quite in range to hit. Jen, good back air, forces KML off stage. And he makes it back. And KML gets a raw uh, F strong. And that'll kill. KML up a stock. But Jen gets a good fair, forces KML off stage. Ooh, and KML gets hit with his own big bomb. And that'll kill him. It's even again. Both players at two stocks. Low percent. KML just sitting patient, throwing out all of these bombs. Good side B to punish the up B with. And a bunch of bombs covers the landing with up strong. Nice. And KML takes another stock. KML getting some good combo in. Jen just looking to close this gap. Throwing out needles to try and stop KML's pokes. Ooh, KML throws that big bomb. Completely misses. But it is scary. Jen trying to fish for some side beats to try and get in quickly. Not quite landing. Oh, KML can't read the tech chase. KML throwing a big bomb, not quite, at 82%, 90%, KML trying to kill, just needs a one good opening, look at that back arrow, now, Ran now Rano struggling, Malo can throw a bunch of bombs out here, good parry from KML, gets the F strong, a good DI, not quite going to die yet, but Gentan is getting knocked off stage a lot, KML just fishing for a good opportunity. Oh, gets another parry, but the F-Strong misses. He's a little too close. A lot of side views from Jen. And a down-strong from KML. That'll take game one. K Malo L. Both of them staying the same character. Interesting. I said it earlier, but these are not... Uh, the most common characters that these people play. So I'm really curious to watch this. We will see where Jen goes for game two. There goes Air Armada. KML getting some good pressure going. He gets reset to neutral. And now Jen has good distance, but KML is retreating a lot, able to make that distance that he needs. Just slowly poke out Jentan with some of these bombs. 
It is tough to parry these bombs, but it is such an important part of the matchup against Malo. You really have to try, at least try to parry these bombs, even if you can't, because parrying a bomb back at Malo is so important here. But KML takes the first stock. Aramada is such a volatile stage. Anything can happen on this stage. Goes for a big bomb. When it hits Gentan and she dies at 34. Oh, wow, not ready to DI that. I, I would not have been ready to DI that either. Gentan just trying to make some openings here with an up strong or a side B or something. Try and close some distance in on KML. You know, KML, keep throwing bombs, just keep throwing side Bs, trying to make as much distance as possible. These flashbangs, not quite gonna hit, but the side B does hit from KML. And get some good pressure going with that. Oh, goes for a fair. That would have killed. An Air Armada, that would have killed at that percent. Oh! Gentian gets pineapple, she gets barely caught under. Air Armada. Unfortunate, that happens to me as a Sail player all the time. That's the thing about Air Armada. But to KML, now up 2-0 against Gentan. Game three, can he close it out? 3-0. Ethereal Gates, good pick, good pick. KML just throwing a lot of these little bombs. As soon as he gets one bomb, he converts off of it. As soon as he gets a single hit. Good side B to catch Gentan's jump. And now Gentan able to get a good combo, even it out. And KML puts some more percent on and gets the lead again. Up air, up airs just keep forcing Gentan up in the air, where it is so hard for Rano to approach, and it's so hard for Malo to be approached. Well, good back air from KML. The Gen makes it back. KML gets hit by a bunch of his own bombs. It's fairly even now. Oh, Gen just barely dodges the F strong from KML. Gets hit with a dash attack and cannot quite make it back on stage with Rano's up B. KML takes first stock. Jen gets some good needles, but cannot capitalize on it quite yet. Trying to get a good combo going. Oh, goes for a raw up strong. One of Rano's best kill moves, but is not going to land here. And came already with these tech chases. Able to keep this pressure going wherever Gentan runs or techs. Good hit from Jen. Ooh, Kamel hits with the back part of the down B. And that kills Kamel up two stocks. Gets a good parry. Only gets 7% off of it. KML not going for as much bombs this stock. He's trying to just play some raw neutral. Goes for a few bombs, but he's going for a lot of these aerials. Up air, fair to try and cover Jen's approaches instead of bombs. Ooh, good fair. And that will kill. Wow. That was a great fair from KML. I'm shocked that killed. The KML will take it 3-0 over Gen 